Hello everybody, and today I will tell you about the functionality of uh, my uh, Unreal Engine plugin uh, Blueprint uh, Multitrading. Uh, first function is enable actor multitrading tick. It's uh, just enable uh, uh, like ticking on uh, any thread. Uh, it means that this event tick can uh, be called uh, in uh, basically in many uh, different uh, threads like in main thread, game thread and like some background threads and uh, so in this case you will like need it to be uh, uh, safety some call some sa uh, thread safe uh, functionality and like that uh, also, if you uh, call in this event tick, in this case, some uh, very hard, uh, uh, big uh, performance uh, uh, functionality, it can like uh, create some stutters and slugs because uh, game chat will uh, uh, wait until this uh, functionality will end it. So you need uh, to be uh, careful with that. And next is uh, run task on background thread and thread logic. Basically, it's the same logic, but uh, it's uh, this you can call in the function, this uh, latent function, uh, latent node, and you cannot call it in function. Uh, first uh, input or output it's uh, uh, call uh, some logic on background thread, and another it's call on game thread. Uh, it's uh, basically the same node, but just to call uh, something uh, in game thread. Another two nodes, it's a development node. Uh, first, it's uh, uh, print to uh, uh, log uh, name of thread where it's called. And another, it's slip thread. It's basically, uh, it's stop thread for some time. Uh, it's uh, give you uh, like, uh, possibility to uh, like uh, simulate a big uh, lot uh, like some hard calculation like that another is implementation parallel 4 in this case uh, your function uh, will be called on uh, like many threads like for loop uh, and uh, this amount uh, of time what you will uh, set it it's uh, all logic will be like uh, call it on many different threads well what uh, Unreal Engine already have uh, run before and I think it's thread actor component basically it's uh, to create another thread and uh, this uh, actor component has a function basically event on another thread tag uh, on another thread uh, tick it's uh, very close to this functionality, but if you uh, like uh, do here some uh, heavy calculation, it will not impact to game thread, so it will not create some stutters uh, uh, and problems. Uh, oh, and uh, in this case, it will be very similar to this. So, in case if you uh, set some uh, in tick intervals or like that, it will work the same. Uh, so, have the same like interval, or if you disable this tick, this tick will not work uh, too. Another thing is Atomic Container. It's uh, mostly needed uh, in case of when we use uh, like Parallel 4 or another things, what I will show uh, next. Uh, so Atomic, it's basically uh, you can uh, add or get some Atomic variable. So uh, in case when we work with some variable in main threads, uh, we will not like overwrite and we will don't have uh, that to raise some errors like that if it's uh, say simple uh, also it's uh, uh, have uh, queue basically it's uh, linked list uh, uh, it's very useful in case when we need to uh, like uh, calculate something uh, on background threads and we can apply this uh, like calculation only in game thread so in this case we can just uh, add uh, to queue this value and after that in uh, game thread just uh, get this uh, data safety and uh, everything will be okay uh, also uh, these nodes it's uh, i don't know how better say uh, adaptive so in case if you p p uh, place here uh, integer it will get integer in case if you, you place here boolean you will get boolean 
uh, in case of uh, get uh, you have a boolean output or in case uh, remove to uh, and you will understand uh, is you get uh, this uh, is you can get uh, this value so uh, basically is this uh, variable exist uh, and uh, next thing it's a uh, thread pool uh, thread pool uh, basically it's uh, you create a pool of threads and uh, after that you can uh, to uh, add to this pool work what you need to uh, what you want to call uh, uh, in this case you just create some work uh, uh, add it to thread pool you can remove this work if it needed uh, in this case you have another test worker for example and you have event on uh, do threaded work so it will be called on this uh, uh, thread and after that you have event on post work so it will be ca uh, called it on a uh, game thread i hope uh, this is will be useful for somebody and i appreciate if you give me feedback okay good luck